Hey guys, um, I'm going to do a tutorial video for uh, Bartender by Rehab. Uh, it's a pretty easy song. It's a fun song to play too. Uh, the guitar is in standard tuning with the capo on the second fret. And the song pretty much goes like this. <laughs> so on and so forth and uh but yeah so for the mm -hmm. intro part of that the little plucking part you know put your index finger on the second fret of the g string and your g string is a fourth string down so if you're numbering them it'd be one two three four five six so it'll be on the fourth string second fret and your middle finger goes on the b string third fret that would be the fifth string. So that's where those two fingers should be. And uh, what you're going to do is with this D string, which is the third string, you're going to play that and put your finger on it. And you're going to play that again. So that's what that should sound like. And then with these, the G and B string, you're going to play that at the same time. And then hammer on with your ring finger on the fourth fret of the G string, which is the fourth string. So when you hammer, you're gonna hammer on and play it again, play it two strings, and you do that twice. So. It's just sound like that. And then after that. If you play that twice, you're going to uh, hammer on, or just play the 4th fret of the G string, and slide up to the 6th fret of the G string. And then you're going to put your index finger back on the 4th fret, and play that. And slide up to the 2nd fret of the G string, and play that. And you're going to put your fingers back to where they were with your middle f middle finger on the third fret of the B string. And then you're going to play the hammer on and whatnot. And then you're going to play it twice again. So that whole thing should sound like this. Should sound like that. And uh, after that, let's see. fourth fret of the D string, which is the third string, and let's see, okay, so you're going to play that, the fourth fret of the D string, and you're going to keep your index finger on the second fret of the G string, and you're just going to play those two strings, should sound like that, and then what you're going to do is put your ring finger on the third fret of your E string, and you're gonna play the bottom three strings. And then you're just gonna play. You're gonna play down, down, up, and then you're gonna put your index finger on the first fret of the B string. So it's down, down, up, uh, index finger on B string, down, and let it off and play down again. So now the whole thing should sound like this. Okay. And then after that, you're going to put your ring in, or not ring, your index and middle finger on the second frets of the D and G string. Those two strings. So you're gonna play down, down, up, and then you're gonna put your pinky on the what is that? The fourth fret of the D string. And play down. Take it off and play down again. So 
And at the end of that, I just like to play two extra strums with the palm mute. Like that. So all together, it should sound like this. plucking pattern for it and for the chords I'm not really sure what the chords are but I usually just play a D, A, and G and A again so but through most of the song it's just the plucking pattern but if you want to play the chords for the verse and stuff it's a D chord and a D chord you put your uh, middle or, uh, the next finger on the third, second fret of the G string, the ring finger on the third fret of the B string, and your ring f middle finger on the high E string, second fret. So it's just like down, 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 up, 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 up. So down, down, up, 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 down. And you switch to an A, where you put your ring, middle, and index finger on the second frets of the D, G, and B string. Same strum pattern. And you switch to a G chord and you just slide your ring finger down to the third fret and put your pinky on the third fret of the high E. And then you put your index finger on the second fret of the A string. And then your middle finger on the third fret of the low E. Same strum pattern. And then back to an A. song you'll hear like they go back to the plucking and stuff so it's, a, it's not that hard but if you don't understand it just message me or something or leave a comment and I'll try and describe it better or something but that's it so I hope this video helped you guys learn that song and I hope you enjoy it thanks